Hey YouTube, hey Bold and the Beautiful fans. So we saw today what happened. This is the beginning of this summer whodunit, this big mystery that we're going to get into. And there's gonna be all kinds of theories. There's all kinds of suspects. So let's get into it. So we saw today Tom performing live at Il Giardino. There was a crowd of people there. We saw Jack is back. We saw Justin, Lee was there. Okay, and of course we have Poppy and Sheila who are potential suspects too. And we saw that encounter between Poppy and Tom. Poppy went over to confront Tom to tell him to stay away from Luna, okay? And we got some good juicy background information too between Poppy and Tom. Apparently Tom has been trying to contact Poppy for years. Sent letters to Poppy, Poppy had them returned. So it turns out that Tom has been trying to get in touch with Poppy, but Poppy wanted nothing to do with Tom because of his lifestyle, okay, being a musician and all of that. So it seems to me, and this is just my guessing here, it, it just it seems to me that Poppy maybe wasn't sure who Luna's father was. Maybe there were multiple possibilities there. Tom being one of them, Bill being one of them, and Poppy even told Tom that she spent that night with Bill, not him, right? Um, there, could, there could be other possibilities. We saw months ago, you know, uh, Poppy looking at Finn strangely too. So that kind of kicked off the whole Finn theory. But it seems to me that Poppy might not have known. And then when the paternity test was taken, then she's like, oh, it's Bill. So. I could be totally wrong about this, but I think Poppy believes that Bill is the dad, okay? And, but Tom believes that he's the dad, and I, I think the show is telling us that Tom's the real bio dad, okay? So Poppy, you know, eliminating Tom, right? Because Tom threatened to tell Luna after the concert that he was gonna go over and he's gonna tell Luna. So Poppy has a motive, right? Nobody has bigger motive than Poppy. But I think maybe the show is, is maybe setting us up into thinking that it's Poppy, but it might not be Poppy, okay? Poppy might be an innocent in this. She might not know, you know, what's going on. Someone else could be orchestrating all of this, okay? So let's talk about who the someone else's could be, okay? We saw Lee show up, okay? What was Lee doing there, right? And Jack was there, Justin was there. Of course, Sheila's there. Uh, and we'll get into Sheila in a minute here, but you know, Lee showing up is kind of strange, you know, and Jack even asked her, you know, I, I didn't know you were into live music, right? And then Lee said she's there for takeout, but then she ends up staying too, okay? And then when Tom collapsed, you know, Lee is a doctor, right? Lee didn't go over to help Tom. So she was kind of indifferent ab about what was going on. And she seemed interested in what was going on too. So could Lee have done this? We saw someone with, with black gloves on, right? Slip some sort of powder into Tom's blue drink. And we wondered would that blue drink become a factor in this? Of course, you know, and it, it was kind of, you know, leading up to that, a lot of us could see that coming. And it certainly turned out to be true. So somebody, you know, through the drink, um, you know, is able to uh, eliminate Tom now, okay? And it, it looks like Tom's not gonna survive, so I don't wanna be presumptuous, but that's what it seems to be. And there's gonna be this whodunit mystery, okay? And there's so many suspects here. Um, but Lee definitely is an intriguing suspect. Could, you know, Lee's the one that administered the paternity test, so, if Tom is the actual bio dad and the paternity test showed that it's Bill, there's an idea that maybe Lee tampered with the test or rigged it to show that Bill is the father. Is Lee trying to protect that? You know, if she's the one that, that manipulated this, then maybe she's trying to eliminate Tom to protect Bill being the father for some reason. Maybe she feels it's better for Luna that way. Uh, or maybe there's another reason that we don't know yet, but I think Lee makes a really intriguing suspect, okay? There's also Jack, why was Jack there? You know, Jack's a lawyer, um, you know, during the show at times, Jack had this kind of suspicious look on his face too, 
but it, it just seems kind of random that Jack is there, Justin too, you know? Uh, why would Justin be there? Why would Justin do something like this? What's the connection between Jack and Tom and Justin and Tom, right? We don't know yet, if any. But we know that we do know there's a connection between Justin and Bill. So maybe Justin is back to protect Bill and to protect Bill's new family with Luna. Uh, but, you know, Justin also betrayed Bill, you know, several years ago when when Bill and Liam were in jail because of the Vinny incident and Justin was holding Thomas captive down in the cellars of Spencer Publications. OK, and Justin wanted to run Spencer Publications himself. OK, so there was a betrayal there. And, you know, so there was a falling out there. So I don't know if Justin would be doing this for Bill. Or, or why Justin would be involved. Maybe he's in town. Maybe he's just in town to help Bill with, with the adoption because Bill wants to adopt Luna. Maybe that's why Justin's there because um, Justin's a lawyer. So we'll see why Justin's there. We'll see why Jack's there. Maybe Jack is there to help Bill with Luna and the adoption. So it's really going to be really interesting to see how this plays out and why Justin was there, why Jack's there. It's going to be interesting to catch up with these characters. It's going to be interesting to see you know, what they're, they were doing at the, at the show. Maybe they just stopped by, uh, but it's definitely interesting. Of course, the show needs multiple suspects, so they're throwing in more characters for that, which is really cool, okay? And, and so now we get to Sheila, okay? Sheila obviously is one of the most legendary soap opera villains of all time, so you can never count Sheila out as being responsible for this. And we know Sheila and Tom had some, you know, disagreements earlier, but they seem to kind of smooth things over a little bit. So would Sheila have done this? Is Sheila trying to eliminate Tom for some reason? You know, I wouldn't be surprised if it turns out at the end of all this that it was Sheila and we're, we're all like, well, of course it's Sheila. Why didn't we think of that in the first place, right? But I'm not so sure if it's Sheila. They've been tr trying, they're, they're, they've been redeeming Sheila and there's kind of this redemption arc, you know, Sheila saved Kelly, Sheila tried to stop Sugar. So why would they uh, throw all of that out and have Sheila, you know, go after Tom? So I don't think it was Sheila. And if you, if you saw Sheila during the show, Sheila was grooving, she was into it, she was having a great time, okay? She was having fun. She seemed to genuinely be living in the moment, okay? Not like she had just, you know, put someone in, something in someone's drink kind of thing. Also, when Tom collapsed, Sheila went right over to Tom, okay? And Sheila is a former nurse, so she went right over to Tom to help Tom. So she seemed to be genuinely, sincerely reacting to what was going on, not looking like someone that would be suspicious. Whereas Lee, you know, as a doctor, Lee didn't go over to help Tom, you know? Lee was just kind of watch watching, you know, with kind of some indifference you know, uh, uh, you know, and, and a look of indifference, right? And, and didn't seem to be all that concerned. So, although I could be wrong about that, but um, we're gonna have to see what happens in tomorrow's show and the aftermath of Tom collapsing here. But there's definitely a lot of suspects. Poppy has motive, Lee looks suspicious, Sheila being Sheila, we, you can never count her out. J Jack is there, Justin's there, why are they there? Uh, do the, is there some sort of conspiracy going on? Does someone want to protect Luna's, the idea that Luna, that Bill is Luna's father, you know, by eliminating Tom. So let me know what you think. What'd you think of today's shocking episode and this big mystery whodunit? It's going to be a lot of fun. It's, there's going to be so many theories coming, but let me know who your favorite suspect is and uh, we can have a lot of fun talking about that and speculating about that, but it's gonna be a lot of fun and I'll keep the updates coming as we get more information and more theories and we'll talk about it here every day. So don't miss a moment. And hey, if you like this video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.